We're talking about work uniforms, if you will. One woman is making a bold decision to just simplify her wardrobe and wear the same outfit every day. She's done it for the past three years. And we ask, good idea, bad idea? Paula Ferris says more. When it comes to office attire, do you channel your inner fashionista like Meryl Streep in The Devil Wears Prada? Or do you go for a more tailored look like Kerry Washington in Scandal? What if you could style your own uniform for work? That's what Matilda Call does. She's an art director at a New York City ad agency who used to dread getting dressed for work. Do you call it a uniform? Yes, a uniform. Why not? So you're never saying, hmm, what am I going to wear to work today? <laughs> no. Three years ago, 27-year-old Matilda decided to eliminate the stress of choosing an outfit every morning. She recently wrote about her experience for Harper's Bazaar. Why did you decide to do this? I constantly was like, well, is this skirt too short? Is this t-shirt too formal? It was stressful. Like, it's so stressful. So what's the uniform? It's a pair of black pants, a white shirt, and a little black bow. You're wearing clean versions of this particular uniform every single day. Exactly. I have about 15 of them. 15 tops, how many bottoms? About six, seven of them. Matilda, who loves to wear colorful clothes after work and on the weekend, says she never gets bored of her work uniform because she spices it up with different shoes. But it's a bold fashion decision for someone who works in an office where there is no dress code. I stand out amongst my friends here, for sure. How big of a burden was lifted off your shoulders when you started doing it? I can't tell you how liberating it is. And I don't think you understand exactly how much time and effort you put into choosing clothes until you don't have to choose. Her choice is saving her money and a whole lot of time. How long does it take you to get dressed in the morning? I would say about 45 seconds. 45 seconds, not even a minute? A minute if you add uh, the mascara. <laughs> For Good Morning America, Paula Ferris, ABC News, New York.